on. Ladies and gentlemen, we're back. Wholesome versus Mutants. Wholesome just about in the lead. We're going to a payload map again, or convoy rather, if you're taking the nomenclature from rivals. I'm joined now by Jason. So I don't have to yap continuously. Yeah, we love to see it. And honestly, this map, I'm immediately looking at the Hella players. Like, they both Tizen and Ant were so exceptional on Shibuya. And I think the long sight lines for this map are just going to give them even more pressure. Hydron up on the high ground here. Needs to be taken out by Ant. He's actually going to be the one to force Hydron away from this. Hydron uncommitted to it for a moment. Of course, doesn't have to... Oh, TZK's taking so much damage trying to take that angle. That's going to put the healers under pressure. Under pressure for sure. Hydron still just like grappling for this high ground. I think he's going to have to take the strange to push them out. Looks like it does. For now though, Sinatra dangerously close to that ultimate already. Yeah, Sinatra has been doing hella damage here. Of course, with the Rocket Raccoon utility, you get that infinite ammo and then the faster fire rate. It's so much damage when you're faced with a group. Here we go, straight away. Trying to make sure that they have the element of surprise. Is it too far forward? Hydra's actually been taken out, but Nuck on the other side has been picked by Hydra. That's the most valuable pick because the Rocket can't get himself. Is it Iron Vagamoto from the back? A weird choice from TTK in what was seemingly a lost fight. Yeah, definitely a lost fight. Oops. Generating pretty quickly, but it looks like the meta, as he said. Uh, Irimich taking over 100k damage last map, and that really is just going to mostly funnel the offensive ultimates for the side of the mutants. But you can't use them when you're down in a fight like that. So beefy is this composition from Holson that they really need a whole wombo combo to try and break through them. And for now, they've only got the copy from Harvey to go, but Vinny's ultimate will be coming up mid in the fight. Oh, what a pick on Sinatra. Should be rezzed, of course, but I like him that gets two, three, even Kaluge. Really good on the follow up. I remix the same. AoE spore grenade carves through the health bars. And despite a well placed early. Wait, did Nuck just manage to get a double res? Nuck might have managed to get a double res. Holy shit, how did this happen? Oh, was it a copy maybe coming through from Harvey? My yeah, goodness. So. That is so smart. Getting the double res. And now we can try and turn this one around. I remix under pressure. TTK moving forward. Kaluge and I remix try to hold the line the healing should be here yes but it can't outdo the damage that's been put forward by mutants and it looks like they might well be able to make this happen kalush has a portal to play with but it's a little bit close to really make it happen yeah vinnie getting the final blow onto kalush and hydron <sighs> as well but all the all the backline all the credit there goes to the backline of nuke and harvey great copy from harvey to duke the rocket raccoon to get the res as well two for one double value not only do you get back in numbers also have to overexpend resources to get the kills and then he's just immediately negated showcasing the power of resurrections in team fighter games uh, absolutely incredible from oh, Mutant TTK is up real far here. Has to be careful about catching that poke on the way out. Shield's already been broken. One of the things I want to point out is that Vinny currently has five of the final blows for his team. You have access here to stats as a spectator, which is really nice. Yeah, it was a TTK 27 and 1 as well with some of the most damage in the lobby. Dr. Strange, though, just seems so, so strong in this meta for a reason. An exchange here of Punisher Ultimates. Plenty of appeal coming through. Oh, Sinatra finds SJP down the long angle. That lack of damage drop off doing perfection for the Punisher. And despite Hydron being down, seems like it is going to be... Oh, wait, they're going to try and turn it around. What's Harvey copied? They've gone for a second rocket again. Maybe a second res beacon. Yes, I Remix has fallen down. Kalu's too. Only one of those can be res, and it's going to be I Remix who's the beneficiary of that. Sinatra seen a push here from Harvey. It's so brave going up against two DPS, and they're punished by Hydron, yes. But they're res... Oh, are they res by themselves? They've been res by themselves. <laughs> That's funny in the kill feed. I bring me back. Yeah, that's, that's a weird interaction for sure. So there's nobody cheats death but me. I am the one <laughs> to beat the Reaper. And it looks like Mutants are going to be pushing this one into second in pretty decent time. Oh, space dodges the eye of Agamotto. Big heads up play right there. TTK now in the midst of the enemy team, but I remix is so low. Trying to keep space alive. Just took too many of the attention and resources of Wholesome. And this is going to be a completion much faster than we saw previously from the side of Mutants. That's a lovely stun orb from Hydron. Yeah, really nice. They seem to be getting the overall gameplay with ultimates and the general flow going down. They've just been so much more efficient with their damage this map compared to the last one. This nuke is going to get a pick onto Hydration to stagger out that Loki. It's going to be bad. He's going to have to walk up without one of their two all-important supports. Although, there's going to be more charge to space, I guess, along the way. I'm going to keep my eyes on SJP. Let's fight like they got that all-important Punisher ultimate. 
It does crazy amounts of damage, and while I remix and Kalud are really, really tanky, they are not that beefy. Amplifier available for it. I like using the rocket uh, utility first to see if you can try and get an early pick and get that resurrection out. I remix needs to flee. A huge amount of space bought right here off of, off the Punisher up, but no kills really coming through at this moment. Sinatra in the crosshairs, but it's going to run out. And now it's a turnaround. Sinatra making sure that disengagement is on the cards. Amped up by the rocket ultimate in kind. Still, the disengage is kind of clean and it's going to be left behind at this point. It is probably going to be a lost cause. Yeah, Hydron's going to finish that one off. And this is a little bit of much needed stability. Wait, a turnaround here. Vinny thinks it's winnable. Brings in the ultimate and has been resurrected. Running out of all Sinatra is down. Is there a raise? There is, but there's only one player to use it. What a block coming through. Kaluja tempted for the ultimate. But TTK was on the other side. And now TTK is so close to his own. Still Hydron bringing down the artillery. So much damage. This should be the end of the fight. It was crazily... It was crazily, crazily expensive. Still, there's not that much presence on car. We've been forced to give us one up as Kalooch is still looking for a pick onto Ant. Hydration's got a copy if it's needed. Yeah, the, the copy should be all important here to go into the return again or to just go into something for the stun. But TTK hits it in the back. It gets one, it gets two. Oh, TTK. That double eye of Agamotto. The follow-up is solid. Hydration and remix down. Kalooch going to be the next. This could be bloody fast from the side of Mutants. What a map for them that it is. Hydron can barely even get out of spawn without being peppered down. Sinatra on the back still can try and make something happen. With the shotgun does get out, but guess what? There's a resurrection available. Hydron has to crow on in. Can't get to a point in time. One minute and 39 seconds. This is quick. Absolutely. That's a record time. And just the ability in which the, the mutants were able to, to keep on fighting is something that I'm slowly learning and we're slowly seeing live. It just feels like the mutants are never really out of a fight. You never really see them hard reset because they kind of just keep winning. Eventually, you know, they're going to get a spawn portal back from the strange. They're going to get a resurrection from the raccoon and that's going to be comboed with an ultimate from Ant to get one or two quite easily. Harvey can even dupe either the strange or the raccoon to get someone back quicker. Just feels like the numbers, the swarm, you see six on the lobby, but really for Wholesome, it probably felt like they had to go against eight or nine on that last push. They were so relentless, so prolific in their kills were mutant that eventually they just had to give did, did Wholesome. Otherwise, like, what do you do? Like, you, you stay and die or you try and regroup and, and go again with your own combos? Yeah, like one of the things about this game compared to other esports we've cast chased is that it really does seem like fights are rarely called as like lost. The yeah. ultimates are so powerful at the moment that essentially if you can find the right angle, any fight is winnable. Oh, 100%. You know, if you've got, for example, the uh, Amor, I believe is, is the name. I apologize. Um, you have the whale plus eye combo, for example. I'm calling it the Moby Dick. Like if you're down two or three in that fight, but you manage to hit that combo, you're going to kill like four people instantly. So... Ultimates are something that you can use to generate a pick, or you can use when you're down in a fight to swing the balance. That's always how they've worked in any game ever, any class hero shooter. When you're down, why not go for an ultimate? Especially something like Strangers for the side of TTK or Kalush, because you charge it so, so quick. Seems like on this map in particular, we've been seeing less play from a stranger with their portals as well. Just playing it a lot more kind of front to front, just hitting each other, trying to get maximum damage off on those strange shields. <gasps> SJP just gets instantly focused down there by Remix. It should be resable, but look at that already. When you don't have that Punisher to just keep the space with the shotgun, you just get run on and Vinny's a victim of that one. This is a beautiful beginning by Wholesome. Yeah, this is a really bad spot actually now for Mutant because I Remix is going to be privy to as many walls as they want. They're going to be construction man building in this room they gotta walk out into them to split the team of mutants that when they can punish but Sinatra dies though so a lot of damage missing now should be reasonable maybe we're a little bit too far up oh, I think the beacon was actually still in spawn if I remember correctly Hydron's down as well a couple ego duels taken and a couple ego duels punished Hydron is of course rezzed up for this one but without Sinatra without that shotgun you have to see the huge amount of space over to TTK who's got themselves a huge advantage on the eye of Agamotto 30% ahead of Kalooch yeah, massive advantage. It looks like they're just going to go for it. Did they get one? Attempt to look for it. Let's have a quick look. Rolling on in, going to the sky. Space manages to dodge it. It's always going to be Space who's going to be the primary target because Rocket can't res himself. Unless he's toppied, of course. The Amplifier given over by Space here. But that could be a massive faux pas, to be honest. We'll have to see if they can manage to clutch this one out. But they're down on players. And honestly, they can't really claim this much space up against the double tank. Definitely not. The pressure that Sinatra and Kaluja are going to have together with those two ultimates is 
masses. I mean, Nuke has their own ultimate ready to go to give them so much damage. Back loaded, let's see what they go for. Sinatra versus SJP. Judge. Early pressure coming in. SJP wants Sinatra. Finds I remix instead. The amplifier is huge. Sinatra's just blown away. So many bullets come forth from SJP. The tracking is good. Sinatra is raised, but it might just be to die again. Hydron taken down from a sky high assault courtesy of Ant, but that was three ultimates coming through from Mutant. Still at this point, they're happy to do any taxing on this time bank because they're playing on borrowed time here. They've already completed. Yeah, ab absolutely. The more time you get on first point as well, the more you should be able to drain going into the, the later points where it takes a while to push and you have respawn advantage eventually. On this part of the map, you do not. Enemy team are going to respawn first, so you're just looking to get as much time off the bank as possible. Brutal comes in though. Got a clue, just frame perfect on these cancels. Loki shift forced out early. That's going to be a copy coming through. What a absolute banger of an ultimate from my remix. Grabs four or three people in, and the walls can finish them all. Puts it up behind them, cuts off the heels, delivers the burst. This should be it. TCK wants to try and turn it around. And? Did he get many? I think it's been blocked here by Kaluge. And though, what is? What are they cooking? Hydron's up in the air. Yes, there's enough heals here. Maybe from Harvey to try and make it work. What is Ant doing? Ant just gets kill after kill. He just pulled this out of his ass. What the hell? Ah, the power of Hella. Nerf this character, please. Absolutely just murdering everyone from afar. Hitting shot after shot after shot. That was the power of the sniper when left unchecked. And now it puts them in a little bit of a hole. So it's wholesome because they've got to walk back into it again. SJP going to be looking for the angle here. I remix looks like they go down. Yes, they do. It's going to be rest by space though. It's still 6v6. Still 6v6, SJP gets that one. That's going to be a co collection of ultimates here. Sinatra just keeping everyone in that area, using the suppressing fire, moving through the choke against the Punisher, unadvisable. They use the portal instead. A nice off angle given, but the surprise is not enough. Space gets taken down and is absolutely on one. Up to the sky they go. Can they manage to take down someone important? Yes, eyes on Hydron. Hella versus Hella. The sky high one wins. Sinatra super low. And now it's on to a mano on mano fight. Still the pocket is there from hydration, but Kaluj gets taken away elsewhere while the Loki is distracted. Even through the smokes, and Archer gets taken down. There's five seconds left. Wholesome are surely fucked. Definitely so. They've got to touch the point and the numbers advantage are just so, so good for me. And they're going to have a strange ultimate coming up soon if they need it as well. But I have Ajimoto is going to stun all of them and sink their chances for this map. TTK has got the one, got the Q button to just end it right here, right now. Kaluj is almost there. Aya Vagamoto ready to go. If only they can find the targets. A touch coming through from the Hulk. Aya Vagamoto, they want SJP. They desperately want the Rocket Raccoon. They find it on the other side. Is TTK going to be any better at this one? Still, it seems like there aren't many kills coming through. Vinny trying their best to survive. Hydron's managing to find the victims here. And somehow they have pulled this one out of their bottoms. Wholesome, stay alive. Somehow, through the skin of their teeth, they're going to have Hydron to thank. And Hydron alone is just in the good aim from that former Overwatch League DBS to really just trying to exert themselves in that final fight. Again, just showcasing the power of the Hella. They found the flank, they found the angle. Looks like they might get dealt here with Ant though, taking the Ego 1v1 after the 4k gets them shut down. Yeah, the Ego 1v1 works out in Ant's favor. Ant's actually been a crazy duelist. I've never heard of this player before, but I certainly do know their name now. Oh, Kaluj actually wants to try and force Ant off this angle. Very risky, misses the Crow, and that's going to be punished. Don't know if it's even reasonable as Ant was so far away on that off angle. Great moves together by Kaluj and Sinatra to take the 2v1. Yeah. And let's see how both of these teams play this fight now, because with the DPS down, it's not going to be as much damage for mutants as you would originally think. The walls are coming up, though, to really just slow the game down for my remake. Really good job to split off and kill space there. Yeah, without that off-angle pressure, though, it's very difficult to try and get value out of the uh, ultimate. Up to the sky goes Hydron. It's a great angle to try and look for. And notice that the back has to crow away once again. Misses the crow. He's good at the hit side. Not so good at the crow. I charge. I charge. The I no. from Kaluj. Oh, no. Oh, God. He went from 600 to zero real quick up against the amplifier. What a turnaround. Oh, you're about one second ahead, Jason. You need to just feather on that pause button. But, jeez. Uh, my bad. Okay, I'm at one minute exactly now. Let's see it. TTK does have eyes. I'm, I'm at one minute, five seconds, well. so you might need to hold off a touch. 
Okay. I'm <laughs> refitting. I'm on 50 seconds now. Oh my god. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> well, it's okay. During the play by play, I'll just have to trust what's happening. I like a murder from my goodness. Multiple players hit. The Loki shift is good. Hydration's on top of that one. And now TTK is kind of feeding into the enemy team. Could be punished here. Up to the sky. I remix gathers people up. Who's active in the air? It's Ant just keeping everyone at bay. Stopping the follow up here as TTK gets rezzed. And now Ant needs to disengage. Too many times has been punished by a bad crow as they disengage. Who's the copy? Let's see where the copy is. It's Hydration going for that second res once again. Hydration res up Hydron. And that JP's been taken down now. All of that additional damage coming through from the Amplifier just makes it so easy for Sinatra to get value. And Space still has one left in the back pocket as well. And can they get a kill before they die? And gets a kill before they die! Wait, can they get two? Surely not. No, Ant doesn't get that one. Kaluj finishes it off. Sinatra so low. Could be found, maybe, but no. The healing's too reliable. Space moves forward with the Amplifier. That's going to be an overtime cap here, surely, for Wholesome. But remember, I don't know. I'm not sure about that one. <laughs> taking it to a wide view. Let's see how it goes. TTK in the back. Nuck with the turnaround. What an amplifier. They can simply focus down Kalud so quickly. This surely is going to be one to one. Remix taken down by the shotgun. There's a porcelain in the midst of all of this, but who knows where it's going. And rezzed up. And surely this is going to be it. Yeah, no touch to be given. One to one between mutants and wholesome. Yeah, and we just see the final image there of Harvey, SJP, and Newt standing alone. It was all they needed. Well, just a shotgun and a, a, a raccoon. That's all you need to dominate the world, clearly. The Marvel Universe fears they cower with a man with a bit too much face paint and an angry raccoon. That is all <laughs> that you need.